did they kick your nuts in? Poor guy. A nice massage will fix up any pains. They, they, this is gonna be Thor Ragnarok. I'm gonna be Rag. I'm gonna be Thor here. Hey guys, before we begin, I just like to give huge shoutouts to the Patreons and the sub subscribers who've uh, supported me thus far. Sebastian, Dominic Ruiz, Victor H, Jeremy Shaw, Darius Tan, CC Anthony, Philip, David S. Edwards IV, Gamer Oz, Jack, Jan Van S, Null, Irregular Inspector, Zax, Titan Leonis, Abdulela, Ice Trainer, Connor Jacobson, Jose Bernabe, Elizena, Russell, Yoyo Dre, Ryder Evans, Sean Thomas, Tim Bobrowski, Fomoran, Kobe Fuselier, Thomas Good, and everybody at the other tiers. Thank you guys so much for the continued support. It really means a lot, especially on this holiday season. So I really want to thank you guys for all that. And I am expanding on this, so formats might look a little bit different because other sites won't let me publicly advertise certain other sites. Uh, yeah, that's a thing. But we'll work on that. Anyway, back to the show. We're live in 3, 2, 1, and boop! Hello guys! California Mackie here, been doing well, and welcome back to another 12 Days of Yai. This episode, we're doing Robin Morningwood Adventure, The Welcome Secret. This is the demo version, if in case you guys don't know. Why am I playing the demo version? Because I need, I need short form for the series. <laughs> Look! I'm stressed up enough as it is. I need to do this in short form order, or else we're gonna <laughs> lose our minds. Mine in particular. So, something interesting about this game is that it's it's not made with Renpy. It's made with something else. So with graphics, let's set it into something a little more feasible on my end, because I'm mo I'm monitoring on one screen. I like that this game has a multitude of options to tailor fit it to your needs. This is great so far, and this is just a demo. I can tell a lot went into customizing it to your feeling. I like the underwear. Underpants, give me underpants. SpongeBob underpants, the brief. What's your name? Robin works. What's your preference? Only determines your weakness during battles. I'm not versatile, I'm a bottom. What? I'm a bottom! I'm a bottom. Oh! <gasps> that was a hand! That was a hand! Believe me! Guys, that was the hand! Click or tap here any part of the screen that's not a button to advance the text forward. Click or tap here to skip the dialogue. Click or tap here to hide or unhide. So, so with that happy Jackie, I mean gaming! Sorry, good game, gamer. You are a gamer. After a long journey over the mountains, across plains, and through the forest, you see a village in the distance. You decide to rest here for the night before continuing on your way. You are exhausted and can only think of the cozy bed that awaits you there, and maybe handsome orc. What? I like orcs. Orcs are great. They're big, they're strong, they're also really big. Down there. Yeah. You have no idea what awaits you there. The road's poorly maintained. It must not be traveled often. Stop there, adventurer! All visitors must pass a test before they may enter welcome! You are, we are not at liberty to say more. Enter through the hatch if you are willing, otherwise you may leave. Oh no! This is not what I ordered from Amazon! Can I investigate? Nope. Nope. I like the I like the options though. The heat in the cellar is unbearable. The more importantly, you find yourself facing a wolf wall filled with torture devices that both frighten and oddly arouse you. Yo, I'm into some freaky. I'm a freaky deaky, like uh, that Nicki Minaj song. I'm a freaky deaky deaky man that's in the city. I like a bit of a chupini. <laughs> A bold choice. We hope you don't live to regret it. Now remove, remove thine un, remove thine clothes. 
You slowly remove your clothes, confused at how strange this all is. The soldiers appear surprised by how readily you cooperate. What's with that face? Also, goodbye, Bronditization. Hi. They, they, this is gonna be Thor Ragnarok. I'm gonna be Rag. I'm gonna be Thor here. They're gonna make me like Thor. You don't put up the struggles; they shackle you to the wall. Actually, you find it exciting. What's with that face? All done. All done. It's counseling time. Why are you like this? Why am I like this? Why are we like this? Why are we the same face? Huh? Why are we same face? Oh no. Am I obvious? Am I sassy? I refuse. I refuse to admit it. But after re-examining the torture devices, you no longer find it exciting at all. Yeah, those things are gonna here to cut. Night set midnight. Let the test begin. Look carefully at the pages of this book. How will you respond will determine whether you may enter the village. Or if we need to dispose of you, you look closely at the cover page of the book. You know it's pretty unlikely, but you really hope it's not an IQ test. Well! Ah, well done, you have passed the test. Now for your reward. Wait, we get branded? Yo! No! Strangely, all you feel is a slight tingling on the surface of your palm. It seems to have appeared as if by magic. As you examine the marking on your hand, you notice that the emblem's identical to the one on the drawbridge. You're now the property of our king. <sighs> We hope we didn't scare you too much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now that you're one of us, we can tell you those torture devices are mostly for show. Yeah. Mostly. Anybody who fails the test leaves without a scratch. But they're always too scared to come back again. One last thing. You may never leave the village again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Never. Yeah. <laughs> welcome to welcome. With the drawbridge barely lowered, the guards escort you through the village gates. You had a chance to escape by jumping into the river, but you didn't take it. There's something strange about this village, and you're determined to find out what it is. We are welcoming. Welcome secret. Oh, oh. Good evening, Monsh. Oh no, he's French. <clears throat> Hold on, let me get into my French zone. <clears throat> There we go. Good evening, mon cher. I am Hubert, the village innkeeper. Mm -hmm. How wonderful. It is a long time since we've had a new guest. Would you like a cup of tea? I have quite a selection of flavors. Uh -huh. Let me say I can offer you thyme, mustard, or snail tea. Uh -huh. Do not worry, mon cher. I am kidding. I do not have thyme tea. It is not very appetizing. You must be exhausted after your long journey. I have a free room available. What do you say? Yeah. First, we got the first room floor key. Come see me in the morning, and I will explain the rules of the village to you. Good night, mon cher. Oh, oh. Your room awaits you upstairs. Good night, mon cher. Can I oh, harass oh. him? Oh, oh. Alright, they won't let me. Okay, there's nowhere else to go. A portrait of the King of Welcome. He doesn't seem friendly. The key doesn't fit this lock. Remember the danger directed you to the first floor. It smells of lavender. The furniture is quite dusty. It's clear over it been been some time since this room was last occupied. It's time to sleep. That's a horrible noise! Sounds like something. Sounds like that ass don't quit. You strip down and climb under the covers. But apparently, the person in the room upstairs has other ideas and has decided it's not your bed. Oh! That's a horrible noise. Like, the floor above you creaks noisily with every movement. Get out of bed and wait for the noise to stop. I would like to adjust that. That is loud. Way too loud for my blessed ears. Oh, 
Oh, there's there's a lot of stuff going on. Hold on. Let me show you guys. Let me show you what's going on. There's a lot going on here. Wood, stone, iron, meat, copper, silver. So we there's material crafting and shit. Uh, that thing in the corner, I don't know what that is. I think that's an item bag. Yeah, an item bag. We don't talk about that. Oh, goodness. Goodness gracious. There's no other way, so oh, out to the balcony. You decide to go out on the balcony anyway. It sounds like the door just locked behind you. I must go. Judy calls. I'm sure we'll yeah. meet again. And I hope to see you naked. <laughs> Seriously? We don't... Nothing? Nothing? Hold on! Why? Why nothing? It was so big. Oh no. This is what I mean when, they, when I say you gotta tease your audience. Oh wait. Click the underwear collection icon to sniff it. No need! <laughs> Musky. I finally did it. I sniffed the briefs of Kite Hasegawa. Just kidding. <laughs> oh, that's not being shown. Sniffing a pear allows you to rel relive or review a scene experienced by... Hold up. How many... Hold on. How many underwears would there be? If that's the case. Fine. After you sniffed the that, you head back to... Why does it... Oh, oh wait. That was... I should have censored it. No. It's unoccupied, what a pity. Okay. I'm glad that I get to explore oh. like that. Hello, Moonshia. I hope you slept well. Me? Yes, always. The properties of some of my tea infusions send me straight into the arms of Morpheus. Mm -hmm. Though some of my teas are also aphrodisiacs, so... Enough about tea, I would really appreciate your help with something. Customers here are rare, so I help sort the mail of the villagers in addition to my job as innkeeper. Yeah. I have a task I must entrust you. Help your bird deliver mail by clicking on the mailbox corresponding to the envelope symbol. There's no badass yet. Okay, so there's different settings. Estimated reward is a copper ore and gold. Oh no! Why? <laughs> oh no! We get the un- Wait, oh. we don't get the undies? Not too bad for them, Precious Postman. Well oh. done! Now go explore, welcome. Other villagers may also offer you work. Do not hesitate to collaborate with them if you want to earn some gold coins, increase your affinity. Oh. You'll quickly notice the welcome men are very amicable. Don't let yourself be intimidated. There are also very few deviants. Something tells me that it won't oh. bother you much. And one last thing. Please take this map. It will help you find your way around the village. It will also help you determine your next objective, so do not hesitate to consult it as often yeah. as needed. Speaking of objectives, you should go find the order in the northeast part of the village. It may have some work for you. My apologies, Monshiao. One more thing before you leave. Please take this. It gave you a mustard infusion. Oh. It comes from my personal reserve, but be careful not to overuse it, or you will, your ding dong, will burn for several days. Why would you give me this? See you soon, Monshia. Go see Orderic. Uh -huh. We have just welcomed a newcomer, Your Majesty. Yeah. I suspect he could be the chosen one. Huh? Oh. Welcome is in bad shape these days.
I'm not gonna say anything. I'm not. But I will say, that's a peculiar eggplant, tomato. And that's my daily gargle. Dark Knight's last attack devastated the village. They also devastated my cr My crotch. Did they kick your nuts in? Poor guy. A nice massage will fix up any pains. <laughs> Show me. It's not funny. You won't be laughing the next time you blow. Just see when. Anyway, I heard we have a newcomer. I sure hope he likes beer and big logs. Maybe he'll figure out how to save us. I hope so too, but in the meantime, stay alert. I can... All this fruit looks juicy, but not as much as the man who's selling them. What do you call a blacksmith who plays guitar? A bardsmith. But the... The song's lyric seems to greatly inspire the villagers. Their recent adventures. Where the beer's delicious and nostalgic. Why is it run down? It's rumored to be full of stuff. Oh, is this guy? Oh. Orderick, you're new to the village, aren't you? Name's Orderick. How are you settling it? Have you met oh. you, Belle? Please tell me you didn't drink as mustard tea. <laughs> Sorry for all the questions. I'm not used to seeing you people yeah. in the village. As you can see, there are quite a few buildings to repair. I'm the master mason here, and at the moment, I'm primarily involved in the village's reconstruction efforts. We've been deprived of a lot of things for quite some time. The tavern, the library, the shops, and so much more. Even though we work hard, welcome is really short on resources and manpower. <laughs> this means I have work to offer you. Help order it by clicking on the brick while corresponding to the hole. Oh, we got to fill the hole! Ooh! Okay. Oh no, it's happening again! I wasn't really expecting that, but okay, come back if you want to improve your woodcutting skills later. I heard that you're repairing a house. Here, take some more wood. Also, here's some of that stew I was talking about. Let me know what you think. <laughs> Don't hesitate to come see me later if you need a job or if you're looking for a good time. It's still working. <laughs> I'm trying to keep it safe so for work. You can hear them moaning if you re listen real closely. Oh. Wow, you just made your first repair. Well done. You definitely won't <laughs> don't waste your time. Well done, little guy. Let's explore your new home. Oh no. <gasps> mm. <laughs> It smells like dead rat in here. Needs a bit of sprucing up before anyone could call it a pleasant place to live in. But one thing at a time, you must have arrived and welcome and you already own your own house. How lucky! <laughs> yep, lucky guy, and rat stew is delicious by the way. <laughs> thanks to you, the village is starting to return to its <laughs> former glory. So thanks, little guy. Maybe it's time to learn the truth about welcome. Welp. Not long ago, the village was at peace. The villagers laughed, played, and feasted together. Everyone was happy. I'm not gonna show this. One day, our king fell victim to a terrible curse that his <laughs> his balls began to grow, and he was enveloped in an evil aura, making him insatiable. Yeah. Somehow, all the pent up frustration from his cursed balls <laughs> manifested as the Dark Knights. At first, we bought them since there were only a dozen or so, then we realized that we could make them disappear by satisfying. Which was much easier than fighting, and all the villagers were happy to do it, especially me, but the Dark Knights' numbers increased tenfold. That's cr- Okay, that's pretty wild. That's not all. We'd known for some time that Welcome wasn't the only victim. They were also attacking all the neighboring villages. The soldiers and warriors from all around had to adapt their fighting styles as well. 
the army was no longer large enough or strong enough to counter their attacks. That's how the insatiable Dark Knights ended up destroying the village. We believe that if someone were able to truly satisfied, it would be enough to lift the curse once and for all. Many have tried, attempting the most unimaginable tactics, but none have ever succeeded. A subscription will help! <laughs> Just kidding. There's a legend that says that one day an adventurer from a distant land will know how to satisfy the king. Until then, we have to endure it, even though it makes Hook look up really inconvenient during an attack. It's getting really sore from all the fighting. A pain shared by everyone, but we need to keep the hope alive. We hope we didn't scare you too badly with that story. Welcome has really good sights too. We'll let you rest for today. How great is sleeping under your own roof? See you soon, little guy. Wow. You know what? <laughs> As you already know, we had to adapt our fighting techniques when the Dark Knights first appeared. <laughs> Teach them the newcomer. To the newcomer, then maybe put uh -huh. them to good use. Yes, Captain Hick. Uh -huh. Anybody here? Hick. <laughs> Beer in the morning. It's really not my style, Hick. Oh, Hick, sorry. Uh -huh. I like to pretend that I'm a wolf in the morning. I'm a, it's a Viking thing. It always puts me in a good uh -huh. mood. Name is Gart. I'm a brave soldier from Malcolm. Even though at the moment I'm more concerned about bringing food back to the village, beer doesn't make itself, you know. Looks like you're new. And we're running out of people to help bring back resources. Gathering outside the village is not without its dangers. You have to have a pair, literally, to have a fighting chance. Mm -hmm. Here, let me teach you the basics. Let's go to the village entrance. We're going into the woods. They're not too far. You may have even passed through them to get here. Mm -hmm. Here we are. Now we can start gathering wood. <laughs> Oh no, it's a thug. Attack! Well... I'm so glad that's over. <laughs> that's a lot to edit out. We made it back with all this loot. Well done. Even though it's mainly because of my skills as a viking, you can keep everything. It's my gift to you. I feel like you have the soul of a true viking. Now that you know how gathering works, don't hesitate to wander outside whenever you want. Most areas around have been deserted because of the dark nights. They're mostly inhabited by <laughs> robbers or thieves. Uh -huh. <laughs> Great. Uh -huh. <laughs> so that's how you fight people. Mm. A new shop's available. Wait a sec! That's what I think it is, isn't it? Well... I don't think we've reached the end of the demo yet, but I feel like this is a good precursor as any. Because I don't have a lot of time to cover because I still got gots to edit for YouTube's edit this and there's gonna be a lot to edit. We got a matching ba ha 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 we they're magic items. That we cannot afford. You know what? We don't have a lot of time, but I think this is good for now. Thanks again for joining me on Robin Morningwood. There's a lot going on here, so I'm thinking... I'm just gonna get the full game. I already like what I see so far. How am I gonna cover this? Well, it's gonna have to be outside of U-Tubs, because uh, that's, got, that's a lot. It's a lot. Anyway. California Mikey signing out. Thanks again, guys, for joining me. 
Consider the game if you want to. It's Robin Morningwood. Alright. You can find it on Itch.io and actually on Steam. It's on Steam. So yeah. It's in convenient areas. Anyways, bye for now.